Hey. So, uh, first of all, hey, wait, before I start, another shout out for this incredible band. Amazing. Um, Nora, how about that amazing all Asian tribute to your transcendence? Um, and now, here I am. Um, hi, I'm Peter Seraf. I'm a, I'm a producer and I'm a big fan and cheerleader of the Woodstock Film Festival. Uh, and I'm overjoyed to present the first ever Transcendent Talent Award to my friend Nora, who is also known as Aquafina, who I'm also a huge fan of. Um, at this festival, where we gather to celebrate artists who are telling distinctive stories, we wanted to create a new award that, that celebrated talent that is breaking boundaries, challenging us to see the world from new perspectives, surprising and stretching our imaginations, and so we decided to call it the Transcendent Talent Award. Now, what do we mean when we say transcendent? Well, we're in Woodstock, so I'm sure everyone in this room has their own definition of transcendent, maybe a story about that time, but no, that's not what this is. That's not what we're talking about. Um, the dictionary defines transcendent as beyond or above the range of normal or merely physical human experience, surpassing the ordinary, exceptional, not subject to the limitations of the material universe. Well, she ain't normal, she ain't ordinary, she is beyond exceptional, and as far as I can tell, she's not subject to any limitations, so she must be transcendent. Um, when we were setting out to cast um, the movie that we made together, The Farewell, um, my producing partner, Danny Melia, uh, said, what about Aquafina? And the writer-director, Lula Wong, said, you mean the, my badge girl? And Danny said, yeah, but she's an actor. And so we got the script to Nora, and she came hard for the part, which was amazing. Uh, she read for it, she called, she texted. She might have exaggerated a little um, how fluently she spoke Mandarin, but um, whatever, she transcended that shit. She, from the moment we saw her as Billy, we knew there was no one else who could play the part and that the reason, I, I, this is really true, the reason the, that movie is so good, and the reason any of you and everybody saw that movie is because of the transcendent Aquafina, Nora Lum from Queens. What's wrong, Dad? Please tell me. Your nan is dying. She doesn't know, so you can't say anything. The family thinks it's better not to tell her. Why is that better? Chinese people have saying, when people get cancer, they die. Nora is the most talented, funny, and hardworking young woman I have ever worked with. And most importantly, she's got such a beautiful heart. Congratulations, Aquafina. It gives me pleasure to bear witness to your transcendent performance in our film, The Farewell. Continue represent. You are literally someone who rises above the expectations that people might place on you, but that you place on yourself because your standards are very high. And I get to see that anytime I work with you and anytime that I hang out with you as your friend, I am really grateful that I get to see all sides of that. Your dad followed me on Instagram. Holy shit. What? <laughs> so? No! Ah! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Holy shit, my dick is out! Yeah. That explains all the likes! Hey there, this is a message from Aquafina's dad, or Aquafina's other dad. There have been so many of us at this point, all taking great pride in her every accomplishment. Reporting to you live from the set of Nora from Queens, which is the picture of transcendence. What makes her transcendent is her wild sense of humor, her commitment to every scene, no matter how many wigs she has to put on, uh, but most importantly, her generous spirit, her kindness, and the way she treats the entire cast and crew. She has this incredible ability to read people, not as a way to judge them, but as a way to understand them. She's like an empathetic sponge. She's also somebody who can have a room full of people doubled over in laughter as she riffs on anything, indigestion, dogs, whatever. But then later, She'll recall every detail of something that you told her about your grandmother. The Nick you're dating is Nick Young? 
Yeah, you guys know them or something? The Youngs are like royalty. Did you not know? Does she not know? What you never seen before? Tell, tell, what are they like? I'm sorry, I did it. It was my fault. I, um, uh, I don't, I don't know what I was. Oy vey. And we're following the queen. It's our only choice. Mm, the turnover in pickpockets is huge. Where she at? Where that bitch at? Aquafina. I could not think of a better person to be receiving this particular award. You are breaking stereotypes every day through the performances that you give, both in comedy and in drama. Go! Ah! Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> There is nobody on earth like you, and you are a really wonderful person and such a good friend, and I hope you are really enjoying the night. I wish I was there with you. Love you. Bye. Oh yeah, Kingston, yes. We out here, okay. Love you guys. I would love to be an adult learner at, at wherever, wherever at the, at the Rock uh, School. I love that. You guys are doing a great job. Um, thank you so much, uh, Mayera, Peter Seraf. Um, when I first got the call that I was getting this award, I was like, what, for what, uh, now? Um, so this is uh, really, really cool. Um, I will say that, uh, well, I don't know what to say. This is pretty, I can't see anybody, but how, is everyone having a good night? Yeah. yeah. Where the ladies at, am I right? Okay, cool, nice. Um, used to work for, a, a intern for a, a paper called the, the Times Union. I went to SUNY Albany, and every time, yes, okay, all right, yes. Um, and every time the Woodstock Film Festival happened, it was, it was always like, shut up, the Woodstock Film Festival's happening. It was like, no one had time for anything. So uh, very honored to be here. I think um, in general, I, I do have, I think my entire career has been defined by just constant imposter syndrome, which nowadays people are like, whatever, imposter syndrome, whatever. But I'd say that that's my career. I don't, don't know what I'm doing at any given time, but I follow a feeling that, that somehow feels right, that the result to me, the work, it, it always feels right. And for all the, the amazing and talented filmmakers here tonight, I hope that you don't know what you're doing the whole time and that you follow that feeling and hopefully it leads you to a, a place like here. So thank you so much, everybody. I'm gonna go, thanks.